Good morning, good morning, good morning. And again, I say good morning. This is the day the Lord hath made. It is the, the day of October the 13th, 2024. I have not seen or have not heard. You have had to enter the hearts of men the things that God hath prepared, that them, prepared for them that love him. God, we come this morning on this day to say thank you. One more day, one more moment, one more second, you've given us life, health, and strength. One more day, one more second, you have given us breath in our body, blood running warm in our veins. One more day, Father God, Father God, we come to say thank you for your kindness and your goodness that you just didn't have to do, but you did. And for that, we say thank you. Now, Father, we pray now that you would again have your way, not by might, nor by power, but by my spirit, saith the Lord. Holy Spirit, I pray now that you would have your way, that you would do what you want to do, say what you want to say, say it how you want to say it. We will get your blessings, and we will get the glory. We honor you, we praise you, and we thank you. In the, in the precious name of Jesus, we do pray. Amen. Thank, thank God for the, again for this opportunity. Thank Pastor Turner for allowing me, Pastor Turner, and continued blessings upon him and his family. Thank him for allowing me this, this moment. Thank God for allowing me this moment to shout out to Pastor Jennings and Sister Jan in, in down in Austin, in Austin, Texas. From the book of from the book of Daniel, chapter 10, God verses 10 through 19, God strengthens Daniel. Ever had a day in your life? Have, ever had one of those moments where you need strength? And I'm not talking about physical strength. I'm talking about that emotional strength, that strength on the that strength on the inside, that strength of your mind, your heart, and your spirit. Ever had one of those days? Ever had? Maybe let's carry it a little bit further. Ever had one of those seasons? Not yeah. It, it's 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 you've been in this for a week, two weeks, three weeks, three weeks, a month, two months. Been in it. Some people have been in it for years, and 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 they need to have some strength that only God can give. Let me repeat that. You need to have some strength. I need to have some strength that only God can give. And that's where, and that's where Daniel finds himself in this, in this morning's lesson where Dan, God says, God strengthens Daniel. He had reached a point in his life where he said, God, I can't do this. You, if you live long enough, if you live long enough, you get there. If you live long enough, you'll run into those moments where you say, God, I, 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 I can't. I've, I've done everything I know how, I've done everything I could. God, it's, it's in your hands now. And, 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 as, and as God strengthens Daniel, the title is you can put your name in Daniel's spot and say, God strengthened and put your name there. Chapter 10, verse 10. And behold, a hand touched me, which set me, set me upon my knees and upon the upon the the palms of my hands, and said unto me, O Daniel, a man greatly beloved, understand the words that I speak unto thee, stand upright, for unto thee I am now sent. And we had spoken these, this word unto me, I stood trembling. Then said he unto me, Fear not, Daniel, don't be scared. For the first day, for from the first day that thou didst set thine heart to understand and to chasten thyself before the Lord, thy words were heard. And I am come for thy words. But the prince, the prince of the king of, of Persia, withstood me one and twenty-one days. But lo, Michael, one of the chief princes, came to help me, and I remained there with the, with the kings of Persia. Now I am come to make thee understand what shall befall thee, thy, thy people in the latter days. For yet the vision is for many days. They're going to still go through some more stuff. And when he, had, when he had spoken such words unto me, I set my face toward the ground, and, and I became dumb. And behold, one, one like the similar dude of the sons of men touched my lips. Then, then I opened my mouth and spake and said unto him that stood before me, O Lord, by the vision of my sorrows, by the vision of my sorrows I turned upon thee, and I have retained no strength. For how can, I, how can the servant of the, this, the, my Lord talk with this my servant? For as for, for as for me, straightway there remaineth no strength in me. I'm empty, Lord. Neither is there breath left in me. Then, then there came again 
and touched me, one like the appearances of a man, and strengthened me, and said, O man, greatly beloved, fear not. Peace be unto thee. Be strong. Yea, be strong. And when he had spoken unto me, I was said, Lord, said, let my Lord speak. Thou hast strengthened me. Hmm. You ever have, ever have one of those situations we, have, we talked about in the opening? Wonder, wondering, what, wondering what God is going to do. What, proceeding to ask God what's next. It was, it was a situation. It was a situation that weighed, it weighed so heavy on Daniel's heart. It's a situation that weighs so heavy on, that on, it weighs on your heart that you proceed to fasting and prayer. It, it was the wondering of, the, of what the children of Israel, for the children of Israel, what lie ahead. They've been in captivity for a long time. It's, it's demonic forces. It's, it's, it's a real battle to receive and, and, and to hear God's response. It's been, over, it's been over 60 years of judgment. God, what lies ahead? God, 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 God I, I messed up last week, and, and I'm still suffering the, suffering the consequences of, of my mess up. God, what lies ahead? God, 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 God I, I, I blew it last year. I blew it last year, and, and, and I, thought I, I, thought, I thought I would be out of this by now, but I'm still having to deal with what I did one, a year ago. God, how long is this going to last? For the children of Israel, it's been, it's been over 60-some 60, 60 years. Daniel's an old man now. Remember when it was Shad, Meshach, and Abednego, and Daniel was, 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 given, was interpreting visions. God was giving Daniel the gift of interpreting visions, visions for them. Now Daniel's an old man now, and, he, and he's wondering, well, and, and the children of Israel have gotten themselves into a mess, and Daniel's wondering, Lord, how long are we going to be in this? God, God, what are you doing? And, and God, what, what, what's next? This, this means, this, means this, this lesson means, then what this lesson means, war. This means war. It was, it was Daniel's persistent, Daniel's persistent and, and trying, trying, triumphant prayer. It's a, it's, a, it's a picture of spiritual forces. It's a picture of, of, of good versus evil. A, 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 a lightness versus of light versus darkness. It, it, it's it's the it's the picture of, of of all of that. And Daniel finds himself in his prayer, and he finds himself. I mean, he feels like he's being opposed in his prayer. Ever prayed so long that you you have you, run out of words? You, you you prayed you prayed last week, and you prayed this week, and you and you know you're going to be praying next week, and you and you and you start to repeat yourself because you have no other words to say, and, and and you feel like God, what are you saying, and what and what are you doing? It's 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 the opposition to it, it, you feel like it's an opposition to a request to a, a God-given request about what God is doing. You, you keep praying, you keep fasting, and, and, and the opposition, and, and, and looking for the fulfillment of a vision, but you're still in it. You, you, you're, you're, still, you're, still in, you're still in under the judgment that you had gotten yourself into. The events, the events prior, to, prior to, this, to this vision, the children of Israel had gotten themselves in, under judgment, and they had been under in, in, in the, the, hand, the hand of God's judgment. And, he got, and God had allowed somebody to come in and take, take them over and, 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 and burn down things and take, and take all of this. God, God, God can, let me say it this way, God can get your attention. You, 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 you can ignore God, you can say it won't happen to you, but God can get your attention. And, and, and that's what's happened to, to the children of Israel. And Daniel's now warning God how much longer? So, some of us, I, I'm going to keep repeating this, but, but, but some of us are, are going through that, God, how much longer? It, it, Daniel was fasting, and Daniel was praying. He'd been fasting and praying for for three weeks. And, and, and what was Daniel, Daniel, Daniel expecting? He was he was he had he had eaten no food, and he had drank no wine. He had and, and he he had he had used no lotion. And, and grief and grief was in Daniel's grief was in Daniel's heart because God, God how long? How, how long? How long am I going to have to it, t take take this? Let me say it, per, the proverbial spanking. How long, God? 
Two years, two year, two years had, had passed, and, only, and, uh, and, 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 and and some of the children, and, and God, and Daniel thought some of the, the children of Israel were going to come out from this. Uh, but, but, and two years had passed when they started go, from coming out. But there's only been a hand few. God, how much longer are we going to be in this? It, 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 brought, it brought grief to Daniel's heart that, that, that now past 90 and, 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 and probably retired, he had fasted for three weeks and he did not get the immediate answer. Because see, some of us, when we pray, we, we're looking for immediate answers from God. We, we're, we're looking for when God, when God, when we get down on my, and, and, and say, God, I'm, I'm struggling with this, and I, and I ask you to help me with that, and, and, and God, will you, will you take care of this, and God, I, God, I need a financial breakthrough, or God, I, 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 need, my, I, need, I need you to, to touch my child's heart, and we're looking for immediate answers, and, and sometimes God says, no, the, the immediate answer is coming, but sometimes the immediate answer has come, has come and we don't know it yet, and, we, and, we, and we're going to get into, we're gonna get into that. That, that Daniel and Daniel verses in chapter ten verses four through six. Daniel encounters an awesome, an awesome be, being, and, and by the by the river Tigris, Daniel saw a, a glorified man, and, and, and no longer no longer does Daniel see an image of a beast, but he sees a certain man. J. Vernon McGee in his writing in his in his teachings believes it was it was it was it was Jesus the Christ. He, he was the man was was in his linen and his belt was was belt was gold and his body was like a gem and reflecting bright colors. His face was like lightning and his eyes were like torches and his arms and legs were like polished brass. But his voice thundered. Ah, to hear the voice of God. To hear the voice of God. Thunder in your heart. Ah, to hear the voice of God speak softly and sweetly to you in your heart. Do you know his voice when you hear it? Because, because if you ever learn, if you ever get to the point where you hear God's voice, or if you ever get to the point where you hear those sweet whispers that God speaks unto you, oh, you're on your way now. Because you're starting to mature to be the kind of Christian that God wants, wants you to be. It says his voice thundered. To strengthen Daniel, to re, this voice thundered, to st- thunder to receive, strengthen Daniel to receive the, the, the importance of the message. The Lord himself, the Lord himself, as J. Brennan, Brennan McGee would say, the Lord himself appeared unto Daniel and talked to Daniel. The, it, the, 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 companions, the companions did not see the vision that Daniel, the, the glorified person, but they did sense his presence and his terror. The prophet Daniel was emotionally overwhelmed and physically weak, and he was stricken utterly with helpless. He had heard, he had heard a voice. Ah, Jesus. He had heard a voice. He had heard a voice in his, in his he had heard an actual voice. Now, he, not, he didn't hear just a voice in his spirit. He had heard an actual voice. And, 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 the other, and everybody with him could not hear his voice, but Daniel heard the voice. Hmm. And, he, and, 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 and because of that, he heard the voice, glorified man, he, he fell deep in the sleep. Daniel was overwhelmed. Emotionally overwhelmed and, and, and physically, and physically, Daniel elapsed into unconsciousness. Ah, oh, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Three points. Three points to this lesson. Remembering the struggle, verses 10 and 11. You remember your struggle. You remember what got you into your struggle. You remember how long you've been in your struggle. And you, remember, and you know what it's going to take to get out of your struggle. Verses 12 through 14. Delayed to discourage. Satan comes to discourage you. Satan does come to discourage you. Finally, verses 15 through 19. Assured and strengthened. God, with, with all that Satan does, God has a way of assuring you and strengthening you that you're going to make this thing. You're going to make this thing. Remembering the struggle. The struggle I could not handle. Daniel writes this book in the, if you notice throughout the book of Daniel, it's a lot of first person pronouns. He, me, and he. It's, 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 a, it's a lot of that. Daniel writes the book remembering that the angel, remember, remembering the angel that God sent to him during the struggle. The more, the, the more personal the struggle, the more we remember the details. How I got in this mess, and the more we remember the details of how I'm going to get out. My soul, my soul. Your soul, my soul, looks back and wonders, Lord, how, did, how, how, I got, how I got over 
It was, it, it was the touch. It was the touch uh, 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 it was, it, 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 that changed Daniel's physical posture and, 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 and his spiritual prosper. And, it, and it, it was, it's getting up from the struggle. The, there, there are levels of struggle, and, and it takes time to get up from one level. That, that we, talked, we talked about how we, how we pray, and we want inst, instant prayers, in, instant answers to our prayers. Sometimes that, that, it takes us time to get up from, from the level we got out, from the mess we got ourselves into. It takes us time. But, and, and, and this verse talks about how Daniel got up from, from one level to another, and he finally got up on, got on, his, got on his hands and his knees, and finally, and finally he stood up. Even in prayer, even in prayer, it's war. Most of us, Jesus, most of us, help me, Lord, most of us don't, 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 don't understand the, 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 the thing of this, this thing called pr a, a prayer warrior. It's a fight. When you get down on your knees and I get down on my knees to talk to the Lord about a specific issue, sometimes it's a fight. Ever, ever, ever prayed, and, and, and while you're praying, it's a fight in the prayer? Come on, talk to me. A fight, a fight, a fight in the prayer. And, and, and that's what Daniel finds himself, had found himself in. A praying and fasting and a fight in the prayer. Dan, Dan, Daniel, Daniel's reference in verse 10 for, refers to a hand reaching down to touch him. It indicates that a, a, heavenly, bidding, a, a, a heavenly being had, in, had entered the sea. It says in verse 2, and, and, be, and behold, a, a hand touched me. He touched me. We sing that song every now and then. He touched me. And, and now I am no longer the same. He, he touched me. In the book, The Battlefield of the Mind by George Myers, there are times when, George, when God changes who he uses in our life. And sometimes God will touch, we can feel God's hand of touch on, him, on us, but sometimes we can feel God's ha hand sending somebody else to touch us. Uh, please, please, please. God, God, God has a way of not only changing the, the, the time and the length of our season, but God also has a way of changing who, who's the person he sends to bless us. Please, 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 everyone, including myself. Don't get, don't get so caught up that you expect brother so-and-so or sister so-and-so is going to be the one that God sends to bless you and to help you. And God may send brother so-and-so, the brother so-and-so who sat over there in the corner and not send the brother so-and-so who sat up front. Please don't get caught up in who God sends, but get caught up in what God is, who, caught up that he has sent somebody and who's using in your life. Daniel, Daniel recognized that God had sent, had changed, and, 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 and sent him and sent an angel. Hmm. From the touch of the hand, Daniel, verse 10, still in verse 10, from the touch of the hand, Daniel, Daniel was brought up on all fours. We talked about how, and how Daniel had got, it was one level at a time, and how Daniel had got up on his hands and knees. From, 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 being, from, from, from remembering the angel, that, that we, we, there are things that God will share with the person who is spiritually, spiritually mature to handle it. There are things that God will share with you when you are spiritually and spiritually mature enough to handle it. It's it's uh, it's, it's like it's like my 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 my, my great grands. One one's nine, one set, one seven, one five, six five. Uh, yeah, you, you start forgetting the, the ages. But there are some things I I I can say to the nine year old. I can't I can't say to the five to the six year old. Because not, not spiritually enough to understand. There, there are some things that some of us, God has been trying to tell, but, but we're not spiritually enough mature to listen to it. We, we, we have our mind made up, and we don't want to really hear what God has to say. And, and, and that's a part of immaturity. When you can't listen to somebody else who God is sending, you are, you are an immature person. Dan, 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 Daniel, from God's perspective, had, God had been faithful. Maturity. Daniel had been faithful. It was it, it was it was in the verse. It was in, in the verse. A man greatly beloved. It was it was God's emphatic statement of uh, encouragement. Daniel, you have been, oh Lord, faithful. Hmm. I have to ask myself the question. You have to ask ask yourself the question, and you also have to answer it for yourself, as I have to answer it myself for myself. Have I been faithful? Have you been faithful? Have you been faithful? Have you been 
faithful from the perspective, from God's perspective, not from yours, not from mine. My, 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 your perspective, my perspective, might say I'm too tired to come to church. God understands. God's perspective would say, uh, I gave you breath today. You better get yourself up and, and, and make your way out to the house. The angel said to Daniel, you have been faithful. Faithfulness shows a strong sense of duty. Faithfulness shows a strong sense of, 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 of consciousness. It, it, in the physical sense, it, it's, like a, it's like two pillars. And, and, and faithfulness is, is, is the pillars that support and hold up the doors. Hey, who, who, God, who are you supporting? Who, who, have, have, you been, have you been supportive in, in the work that God has set and called you and assigned for your hand to do? Have you been supportive? Get out of there. Daniel, not only, Daniel, Daniel, not, not only have you been faithful, but God tells you, oh, if you ever, if you ever get the sense in your spirit that God says you are greatly beloved. Verse, verse 11. You are, you are, you are greatly beloved. The record, the record, <laughs> the record is Daniel is one of the greatly beloved, one of the best, one of the most valuable, one of those who rank high among the servants. How about you? How about me? And, and understand, the ranking doesn't come necessarily from individuals on this side of heaven. The ranking comes from God. And, 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 and oh, thank you. And, 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 and let me go back to something I just I said earlier. You know. You know whether you've been faithful. You know where you've been valuable to the God. You know where you've been conscious to God. You, you know where you've been supportive to God. You know. He's, and he, 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 said in, he said in verse 11, and he said, Oh, Daniel, a man greatly beloved. You want him of the best, one of the valuable, one of the, one of the commendables, one of those who, who, who can give, I, I can give honor and, and a little bit of praise and glory to. Now, oh, oh, Daniel. God says to the great we will love that he has a message for them. You need to, under, you need to understand that to understand the things of God and, 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 and understand where God is taking you and what God is doing with you, you need to be spiritually mature. Under, the, the word understand in, 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 in verse 11 talks about to discern, to comprehend, to comprehend the message that is being expressed and the message that is intended that comes from God. The message, the message, his word, the message, the message, his thought, the message, his mind, the message, his actions, what you, what you, what you, what you can hear and what you can perceive in your spirit that God is saying, the message, the message. This, 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 this encouragement, stand up, stand up, stand up and be a witness, stand up. To stand, stand, stand up to receive the, the, the stand up to receive to receive the message that, that God has for you to receive. The, the angel's message I have been told is I, I have and, and the angel says says the angels come in verse also in verse eleven says I have been told to tell you this Daniel. Yeah, that's good. I like that. There are times. There are times. Lord Jesus, there are times even when God shares the message to us that the message overwhelms us. In verse, and still in verse 11, Daniel was overwhelmed again. It says in verse, and when he had, when he had spoken the word, the message, I, I, I stood, I, I, I stood trembling, motionless. I stood in position. I, 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 I stood re, re, reflective, re, respectfully before you, remembering the struggle. But as you remember the struggle, as, but, as, but, as, but as you remember the struggle, understand that sometimes God's answers come at, come, don't come at our pace. God's answers come delayed. Delayed to be a, delayed to discourage. Let me cut through this. Let me cut through this. It's, 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 it's a satanic strategy of delaying God's answer to your prayer. It's a satan satanic strategy. 
It's a plan. It's a purpose put in place to delay God's answer to your prayer. Satan creates situations. You've been praying for, you've been praying for, in the, in the lesson Daniel been praying for three weeks, 21 days. You've been praying and you've been praying and you've been praying and you keep wondering, why hasn't God answered my prayer? <laughs> Satan knows each one of us. And Satan puts in place things to discourage us, to help us, to, to help us give up hope. Say, let me say it differently. Satan wants you to quit. He wants you to quit. Satan, Satan knows each one of us, and, he, and for each one of us, he knows the tactic that will work, that, that will work against each one of us. No, no one understands that your prayer was heard the first time you prayed it, and don't think that God had, don't think that God did, has heard your prayer and ignored your prayer. My loved one is sick, and they're staying sick, and God, they died. I heard your prayer, and, 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 and Satan got involved in it, and, and, and they died. But you ever thought that sometimes God is simply saying, that I know what Satan's tactics are, and even though I know what his tactics are, I still gonna answer the prayer the way I want it answered. And sometimes, sometimes God's prayer for your loved one is to come on home. Don't be apprehensive. Don't be scared. Don't be, don't be anxious. Verse 12, about your prayer. Then said, then, 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 then he then he said emphatically to me. From the first time you surrender, uh, fear not, Daniel, from the first time you surrender, from, from the first time you made the decision to, to pray, from the first time you were persistent to pray, I heard your prayer. Sometimes, this is funny, so, so, some, sometimes husbands and wives sometimes have, the, have those discussions. You know what I mean by that. We have, the, we have those discussions. And, 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 and one will say to the other, did you hear me? And the other one will say, mm -hmm, yeah, 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 I, I heard you. Well, kind of, kind of, kind of similar to that is we, we ask, we keep asking God, God, did you hear me? And, and God says, yeah, I, I heard you. I, I, I heard you. From, from, the, from the first day that, that, you just, that you surrendered, surrendered, God's heart was touched by, by, the, by the prayer, by, by your prayer. God, God's heart was touched by, touched by Daniel, his dear servant's prayer. From the first time you stood it, you stood and recognized. The first, not, 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 not only did I, I hear your prayers, I re recognized your prayers because you were persistent in your prayer and you surrendered and you were humble in your prayer, but I also heard your prayer. I, 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 I also heard your prayer because, uh, I, I'm going to slow down, because you, you, you did chasing yourself to humble yourself before me. I'm repeating myself. Not only from the first time you surrendered and you made the decision to pray, but, the, but I also heard you when you chastened yourself and humbled your spirit. A humble spirit. Humble spirit. No, please, please, please. I, I know most of us know, so know this, but every now and then we need to be reminded. Don't, 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 don't approach God in your arrogancy. Don't, 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 don't approach God in, you, in, in your, I, you have to answer my prayer. Don't, 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 don't do that. I heard your prayer. You, you were, you, you, you were, you were, you, you chastened yourself and you humbled yourself. You, to, 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 you willingly reduced yourself in, in rank and in stature, and, 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 and you, 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 you lowered yourself down in your attitude and in your spirit. Daniel, I am come. Verse ten, verse twelve. I, I am come for thy words. I'm come to answer. I've come to answer your prayer. Understand that in the spiritual realm, there are battles that go on, battles that delay the answer to your prayer. The Lord had immediately, had immediately commissioned, commissioned the, the angel the, the, to reveal the future to that. Daniel, you keep you, Daniel, you want to know what's next? I sent an angel to tell you. 
but he, but it's, but he, he didn't get there because, because the, the, the deceiver, the, the liar, the, the trickster got, got in the way and, 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 and caused another situation that delayed the answer to your prayer, that, that, that delayed you even knowing about the answer to your prayer. It's the flat tire. It, it, you, you, you prayed, uh, uh, for, you prayed that, 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 that somebody would help you on, 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 uh, help you in the situation that, that you got yourself into. You're on your way to work, and, 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 and you're just praying, and, and you're just praying, and, 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 you, and you just know God's going to send somebody, and, and, and God puts, a, puts it on brother so-and-so's heart, or, or brother sister so-and-so's heart, and they're on their way to help you. They're on their way to help you, they get a flat tire. You know what that was? That was Satan's, that was Satan's strategy. Somebody, somebody, some, uh, somebody left, left the bottle out in the middle of the street, and you ran over, they ran over and got a flat tire. That was, that was, that was, that was satanic. It's, it, it, it's, it's, the rail, it's, it's the, it's the train at the railroad crossing. Normally the train hits that railroad crossing, hits that railroad, and it's gone. But today the train is slow and it's long. That's the, that. There are some times when the, that is satanic by Satan to the delay the answer to your prayer. <laughs> the ding, the, the, it, in, in the lesson, it was the ding, demon over the kingdom of Persia, verse thirteen. The demon over the, over the, 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 the demonic prince over Persia had resisted the angel, the, the, resisted God's angel, delaying Daniel's, delaying God's answer to Daniel's prayer. Some, some, of, some of the delays to your prayers, not, and, 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 and please, let me, let me back up. This is, not, this is not all the time, but this is sometimes that the answer to your prayer is because of, of a satanic strategy by Satan to delay getting the answer that you need, to, do, to delay your blessing. Two interesting, two interesting thoughts. Two interesting thoughts. It, the thought, it, it's the thought of the, high, the, the hierarchy of the angelic world, uh, angelic world. Michael had to come. Who was Michael? Michael the, the angel. Michael. Let me use it in this term. Michael, the supervisor of the angel, the angels, had to come and get, and get involved. And, 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 and while that angel dealt with another situation, Michael had to come and, and, and answer your prayer. It says, it says, it says, it says in, in the verse, Lo, Michael, one of the chief angels, came to help me. And, 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 this, and this is the one angel talking to Daniel about how Michael, the chief angel, had to come and help him because he had got himself involved, trapped over in Persia, and couldn't get out of Persia because he had to deal with a mess over there. But now I'm, but now I'm here now, verse, 15, verse 14. I'm here now. I, I, I am come to make thee understand what shall befall thee in, in the latter days. I'm going to tell you what. You, Daddy, you, you want to know what's getting ready to happen? I'm getting ready to tell you. No, 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 no. Let's skip that. Uh, they, not skip, skip that too. That's, Satan, has, Satan has succeeded in accomplishing his purpose of discouragement. Satan, Satan's, purpose, Satan's purpose in the series, Satan knows that, that, that the weak he can get any day. He, he, he knows brother so-and-so has missed three weeks worth of church and, 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 and has no intention of coming in week number four. He, see how he knows that? He's not, he's not even bothered with brother so-and-so or sister so-and-so. He, 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 he knows their attitude. He knows their spirit. He know, and he's, he's got them right where he wants, but he's after you. You who, you who come hell or high water, it comes six inches of snow on the ground, ten inches of snow on the ground. You make your way out to the house of God. He's after you. And, and, what, he, and what, what Satan hopes to do with you, what, because, because of your attitude and your spirit, Satan's only, only strategy with you is, I, I, I know you're not going to quit. I know that. I've been watching you for years. You, you, you make it there no matter when. Nobody else will make it there. You're going to make it there. You're not going to quit. But what I can do is I can slow your road. 
I can slow you down. I, I, I can slow, I, I, I can, that, that hope that lies within, I, I can start working on that hope that lies within. And I can start pulling some of that hope that lies within. And I can start pulling some of it back. And, when Satan st and, stay, and if you're staying there long enough, Satan says, I will get you. Oh, Jesus is good. One of Satan's Satan's strategy is discouragement. When the hurt runs deep, when the hurt runs deep, do you recognize any of these any of these words? Have you ever said any? Have you ever been have you sent any said them or experienced them? Anger, pa pain, panic, lost hope. Why, God? Why? God, I, it, God it, 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 it wasn't supposed to be this way. God's, God's response to Satan's attacks, God knows how to respond to Satan's attack. God, God knows our, Satan knows our weaknesses, and he has more than one attack for discouragement. And God understands it. God, God's response is, I am come to get you to understand that I have power over Satan. I'm, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you out of things, out of this mess. Three things. Three things about understanding. Understanding God's answer to the prayer and discouragement is is number in verse fourteen. Now I am come. Who is affected by and, and make and make thee understand who what shall befall thee? I, I, the, the, who who is affected by the prayer? The second thing is who is the subject of the prayer? Who is the, is the subject of the prayer? No. The second thing is when will the answer of the prayer be accomplished? The th and the third thing is, how long will it take for the results of the prayer to take place? Ver the, the, the number two was in, 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 the, in the latter days. Uh, 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 in other words, this is for this is for a future end. You got a little while yet to go before the the, the answer to this prayer comes happens. You 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 pray you 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 sin for a long time. You got out there and enjoyed yourself, for, and I kept telling you to stop. And, 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 and you kept on going. And so now, now, that you, now, now you think that I'm going to flip this thing around and get you out of the situation overnight. No, I'm not going to. For God, for God, for God is telling some of us, no, I'm not going to. I'm, I'm, if I'm going to get your attention one way or another. No, I'm not going to. I, I told you 25 years ago, leave her alone. I told you, I told you three days ago, stop seeing him. But you kept on. And, 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 and now you want a quick answer to your prayer. And God says, no, this is for the latter days. You got to deal with it now. We don't, we don't, we don't like to talk about this. We, we, we like to talk about God's going to get us a pie in the sky and God's going to get us out of this mess right, right away because it, it, sometimes he's not going to. Let me quit. One of the, la the last point. My last point, I think I got about three minutes. Assured and strengthened. The God effect that the, the God effect that 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 counters discouragement. Verse 15. Overwhelm, overtaken with excitement the, the, is the other side of overwhelm, the other the over the overtaken with excitement, which is the other side of discouragement. Da Daniel realized the great sickness, the intended meaning for what God was planning to do. And 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 and, and Daniel being prone again, prone again to, to emotion to emotion fainted again in verse 15. And, and but in verse 15, one one, one more time, a, another angelic me messenger comes to encourage Daniel. And touching Dan the angels, da touching Daniel's lips, the angel able to and able to prophet to speak. And and and, and, and he said, and like the multitude, the sons of the sons of men touch, 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 touch my, touch my lips. And and Daniel told the angel that he was terrified at the spiritual warfare. Warfare is warfare is no is, warfare, warfare is no plaything. Spiritual warfare is no plaything. Verse sixteen. Then I opened my mouth and spake and, and said unto him that 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 stood that stood before me. I'm scared. O oh Lord, my, by, 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 by the visions, my sorrows are turned upon me, and I have I retain no strength. I'm, 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 Lord, I don't have anything left. 
We, op we, open we open this lesson with a asking you about uh, have you ever got to a point where you had nothing left? Daniel had gotten to that point. He had, he had nothing left. When you, get there, when you get to that point, sometimes God's got you just where he wants you. Well, you can't rely upon yourself and you can't rely upon your strength and you can re can't rely upon your job, your status, your money, your, your, your career. You can't rely upon it. All you, all you have left is God. Verse, let me quit. The angel had touched, had touched Daniel, had touched, restored Daniel's voice in verse, in, 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 in verse, uh, excuse me, let me slow down. That, that, seeing how emotional Daniel had, had, had and, and Daniel was, and weak Daniel was, the angel touched him again, again and gave Daniel some supernatural strength. Verse 18. Gave, gave Daniel some super. Now, on top of Daniel's natural abilities, God put some super into on Daniel's natural abilities and gave Daniel some supernatural strength. He said, he said, he came, the verse said, then, then there came again that touched me, uh, one like the appearance, and, and, and he strength, and, of a strength of a man, and, and he strengthened, and he strengthened me. The angel had, had earlier touched Daniel's voice, but now the angel touches, touches Daniel and putting, putting physical strength into him. Told, told Daniel to be strong. My injunction, my, my rhema word to somebody today is be strong. Be strong in the Lord. Be strong in the Lord. Let me go back to one of my favorite scriptures. Not by might, nor by power, but by my spirit, says the Lord. Don't be strong. Don't, don't try to be strong in your strength, but be strong in the strength and in the power that God will put in you. And if you do that, you will make this thing. Daniel, in verse 19, O man, be greatly beloved. O man, <laughs> O man, be greatly beloved. Valuable. Commendable. Right high, um, 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 old, old, old man, the old man greatly beloved. Now was not the now was not the time to criticize it, criticize Daniel for falling out, but now was the time to encourage Daniel with the strength that God was putting in him. Some some, some of us, some of us, all we need is just one more piece of strength that comes from God, to know that we're gonna make it, and when we rely on that strength. He told Daniel, fear not, be strong. And we had, when he had, and, and we had, he had spoken unto me, I was strengthened. And said, from, and let my Lord, for thou hast strengthened me. Peace is pronounced over Daniel's life. Peace is pronounced over this, over this situation. Peace, peace pronounced, peace is pronounced upon Daniel. God will pronounce some peace over your life. Even in, even in the middle of your mess ups, even in the middle of waiting on the answer to your prayer, God will pronounce some peace and let you know weeping may endure for a night, but joy is coming and it's coming in the morning. You will have and I will have and we will all have if we rely upon God, strength to move forward. God, our Father, we thank you. Thank you for this lesson. Pray now that something has been said, something has been put forth that will help somebody to realize you hear their prayers, you haven't forgotten them. And, you, and if, you, if they hold on and depend upon you and, and, and understand that there's a war going on in their lives and understand that God wins all wars with Satan, that if they will hold on and trust you, God, everything's going to be all right. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen.